Hi all, let's prepare masala vada today. This is just like falafel. This is very easy and tasty, crispy fritters. So let's start preparing. If you are new to my channel, please like, share and subscribe. And watch a lot of our cooking videos. So now let's take 2 cups of chana dal. Wash it well and soak it overnight or just for 5 hours. Usually 5 to 6 hours will be sufficient. Now you can see the chana dal looks like this. Now let's make other preparation. I have taken 10 to 12 cloves of garlic, 1 inch of cinnamon, 5 cloves, 6 green chilies, salt and ginger. Along with all these ingredients, take 1 handful of chana dal. Add everything into mix your blender and make it a coarse or nice good paste. The paste is ready. Transfer this paste to a bowl. The remaining chana dal should be again added to the mixie and make it to a coarse paste like this. Now let's go for mixing of the masala vada. Now I have taken 2 cups of chopped onion, 1 cup of cilantro that is coriander leaves, 1 cup of mint leaves, 1 cup of dill leaves. Dill leaves is optional. You can either add it or avoid it. I have taken half cup of curry leaves which is chopped all these are chopped all these ingredients along with the paste which we prepared earlier we'll be adding it into the chana dal along with the paste which we prepared i'm adding dill leaves mint leaves cilantro curry leaves chopped onion we have already added the salt while making the paste of green chili ginger all those ingredients you can check the taste and then you can add salt if you need it. Now I have mixed everything well. The blend is ready. Now we will go for deep frying. Take oil for deep frying. Let it become hot. Just medium flame hot. Take the prepared masala vada blend. Make it a round ball like this. Press it flat. You can give different shapes like however you want to this. Masala vada. Put it in the oil. Cook on both sides well until it becomes golden color. It takes around 5 to 8 minutes to cook in the medium flame. Let it cook. And one more thing all my written recipes is in my website and Facebook page. Do follow it and support me. The link for website and Facebook page is in the description. Now you can see it is completely cooked and it is golden color. I am transferring it into a plate. The tasty tasty masala vada will be ready to serve. This will be tasting still more awesome with red bell pepper chutney which I have already posted in my website. If you wish you can check it. I will also put this in the description box. So the tasty masala vada is ready. Hope you all enjoyed cooking with me. If you have enjoyed, please like, share and subscribe. We'll meet in next recipe. Until then, bye-bye. Take care.